Hey guys, welcome back to Infinite Warfare. And thankfully, if you still play this game, we do have a bundle in the supply drop system. Uh, last week, we didn't have one, and the week before that, we didn't have proper art for the bundle, so it, it was just me, like, speculating that maybe they were starting to lower down their support, but I don't know, maybe it was just a, something that happened and they just couldn't fully um, update the quartermaster system or whatever, but um, anyway, so I have enough keys to do this twice, and um, this is one of those bundles where it's either... 150, 165, or 180, and this week, um, I mean, it's actually something good, it's not, this is me personally, because I don't use shotguns or sniper rifles, but it's usually shotguns or snipers, or it's sometimes an SMG bundle, or like an SMG pack with five pack bundle or whatever, or it's that um, Hyper XP SMG, which is basically just the Mark II um, rare or better SMG hack. So this is an assault rifle bundle, so it's much better in my opinion, and it's 150 flat, so you're not even paying for the um, the assault rifle hack. So I would highly recommend you guys use this one, or you know purchase this one, not with COD points, but with keys if you still have keys and you still play this game. Um, this is about as free as it gets, I think. Um, those really big bundles where it's like, um, what was it, uh, 400 keys or, or 600 keys or whatever those massive bundles are, um, it's really hard to gauge whether or not it's worth the time you invest. Um, for me, you guys know how I get these keys. It's not through, um, it's not through, how am I supposed to, uh, how, do I, how do I put this? Um, how am I supposed to put this? <laughs> um, it's not through, there's no integrity. It's through the, um, the, the um, uh, what's it called? The, um, the glitch. You guys know the Shaolin Shuffle glitch. So I, that's how I earn my keys. Um, I just like opening these to see what's, uh, well, not new again. It's, it's just what's different. And I like to, you know, for those of you that still play Infinite Warfare, it's sometimes nice to know um, whether something's available or what's in um, what's in the Quartermaster system or whether it's worth it. So that's why I kind of try this. Like, it's to, it's to satiate my own curiosity and also to post the video to see if you guys want to give it a shot, if you guys have never done it before, and um, whether or not you want to gauge whether or not it's worth it based on what I get. So, um, I mean, well, <laughs> it's... The Horizon's great, or I guess it was great until they fixed what was weird about it. And before, you used to be able to get, um, I think, a deatomizer strike after 26 kills, which was not 25, so that was a little bit weird. But afterwards, you could get, I think, 11 kills? Because I think at the 15 kill mark, you unlock the ability. You get the, um, what's it called? The uh, um, the nuke gun perk, I think. So once you you know use that, um, you can get a deatomizer strike after 10 kills. So... Um, the math doesn't really work out, I don't think, but it was 26 kills for some reason, and then after that it was, uh, it was either 10 or 11 after that, so it, it was really cool because you could get basically, okay, well, these are all really old, but, and I got duplicates salvage. I, the last video I made, I got duplicates, I think it was the, um, it was it the, uh, oh god, what's it called, uh, whatever that semi-automatic, um, the G-Rail, I think I got, like, duplicate G-Rails, like, right next to each other, and that was exactly the same placement as the Salvage, but I guess I'll open two commons, why not? Um, what was I saying? I think I was talking about the Horizon, <laughs> or, not the Horizon, uh, yeah, the Horizon, um, uh, the Exion Horizon, but it, it was just really weird, because you could, you could drop, like, doubles and triple deatomizer strikes if you really, if you got lucky with the lobby, you could, and with TDM being the only thing which is really playable nowadays, um, it, it's just... It makes it doable because before, like, that kind of stuff was in Domination. It was in, um, what's other objective modes I'm trying to think of? Um, I think it was really just Domination, really. Um, I think there were some other OBJ things I was, uh, what was the one where you get the ball and you have to go to the center or you have to, like, dunk it? It's kind of like Infinite Warfare's version of, um, Uplink. I mean, maybe it was Uplink. It's their version of like what Blitz used to be in um, in COD Ghosts. So whatever it was, that's that's another way you could get it. But people really stopped playing that a long time. Oh, I guess I could do this. People really stopped playing that a long time ago. So um, I played it way early in the game's life cycle. But again, like it gets very depopulated over time, just like Domination. So really, like it, it was nice to know that you didn't have to go on a 50 kill streak to get two deatomizer strikes. You could just you know get um, either either 48 if if that if it was 11 kills to get the next deatomizer strike or uh, 46 so it was nice to know you could you could well okay not bad not that i, <laughs> I care though but just whatever uh, oh I, i'm out I, I can't math um but anyways yeah guys so um got some good variants i'm not sure if i'm gonna use them because um i mean i would only ever use the horizon but then it got patched so you actually have to get another 25 kills to get the next deatomizer strike so the quirky weirdness of that variant is gone so i'm probably not going to use that but there were some nice variants i might use them in zombies maybe who knows but 
Um, anyways, yeah, guys, um, thank you so much for watching this video. Um, again, out of all the bundles, like the small bundles, I call these, these are the small bundles because it, you don't spend like hundreds and hundreds. It's like, you know, it's 150, 180, 165. It's not like you're spending 400, 600 plus or whatever to get it. So I like to call these the, um, the small bundles. So out of the small bundles, this one's probably the best one to get because you are getting something for free. So it, it's just nice to know you get something for free as opposed to paying, you know, for half a, half a supply drop with the 15 keys or you're actually just paying for it with the 100 80 total so it's nice to know you get something for free so if you want to give it a shot i would recommend this one out of all of them so you know give it a shot if you want to because i think most people like ars it, it's it, it's it's really balanced like the weapon class in general is just very balanced as opposed to lmgs or smgs or shotguns or whatever so out of all of them it's it's probably the most practical but that's just my opinion but um anyways yeah guys um thank you so much for watching this video and like always have an awesome day i'll see you all in the next one